Hi viewers, welcome to my channel Naveen Velchuri. In today's video, I am going to discuss about a linear and non-linear system in digital signal processing. So a system is said to be linear if it satisfies superposition principle. If a system is linear, it is superposition principle compulsory satisfy chayali. In case it is satisfy chayali, otherwise the system will be called as non-linear system. So, as a superposition principle ante ante, where superposition principle states that the response of the system to a weighted sum of signals should be equal to corresponding weighted sum of outputs of the system to each of the individual input signal. Ante, manakoka two input samples ganaka unte signals, input signal samples. For example, x1, x2 anukondi. Anukonte, R end tiki manok responses and founded chest are responses weighted responses sayundali. So the individual weighted response sum is equal to overall system weighted sum of the values when these two are equal. Epudate system yoka individual responses weighted sum of individual responses is equal to weighted sum of overall response of the system outundo, then the system is called as linear system uh, if you see here i am uh, representing a mathematical expression i uh, choose a mathematical expression lo t of a1 x1 of n plus a2 x2 of n adi em indicate chestundante the output of weighted individual input signals overall response adi equal to weighted sum of individual responses t of x1 of n is response of x1 of n input and x2 of n is x2 of n input are equal the system is linear otherwise if it is not equal then system is called as non-linear system so to verify the given system is a linear or not i am giving one example here so i am taking one example here a system is represented with its response y of n is equal to n into x of n that is the system response i have taken where x of n is an input and y of n is response of that system and response of the system and modification of the input signal and matter now i am taking the two individual samples for the given input signal kabati x1 of n input aithe nenu x1 of n and x2 of n ane rendu individual samples kinda teesukunna appudu vaadi yokka responses anevi individual ga x1 ku vachesariki y1 of n avutadi and x2 ku vachesariki y2 of n avutadi so y of n anedi n into x of n aithe y1 of n response em aithante n into x1 of n just x of n place lo x1 y of place lo y1 teesukuntam alage similarly y of place lo y2 of n and x2 x of place lo n into x2 of n teesukunam so let these two equations I am giving two numbers equation 1 and 2. Now I am adding you put in just now equation 1 key equation 2 key weighted value assign just now to some arbitrary constant a1 and a2 to equation 1 ni equation 2 ni multiply just now similar ga. So a1 y1 of n equal to a1 n into x1 of n a2 y2 of n is equal to a2 n into x2 of n out three. So you need to give some equation 3 and 4 and numbers assign yes. Now I am adding equation 3 with the equation 4. Then I will get the uh, right side part of mathematical expression I have mentioned. So a1 y1 of n plus a2 y2 of n is given by a1 n into x1 of n plus a2 n into x2 of n. You need to learn n common this kunte. So, we are having n into a1 x1 of n plus a2 x2 of n. Let the equation 5 and number assign yes. Now, coming to the left side uh, expression, t of a1 x1 of n plus a2 x2 of n. The overall response of the system is taking. Man kichi in the response y of n equal to n into x of n. Kanaka, ipun ne no. This is the T of entire A1, X1 of N plus A2, X2 of N. This is the sum of Y of N. In this place, we replace N in this place. So, N into entire this expression, I am representing under X of N place. X of N place, we represent this. 
now n into this we are getting now i am multiplying n of two uh, some values then i am getting the a1 n x1 of n plus a2 n x2 of n so now i am taking equation 6 for this now by comparing lh side and rh side of equations 5 and 6 both are same so it satisfies the superposition principle hence the given system is a linear system so this is an example for uh, representation of a system which is belongs to the linear system now i am taking one more example which represents non linear system representation so i am taking the second example uh, for that i am taking the response y of n is equal to x square of n where x square of n is the input and y of n is the output response similar to the previous example in the uh, example madrigan ekkada kuda rendu individual samples ni x1 of n x2 of n ani cheppi teeskunnam vaati yokka individual responses x1 kemo y1 no x2 ki y2 teeskunte y1 of n is equal to x1 square of n and y2 of n is equal to x2 square of n for these two uh, assign two equation numbers equation 1 and 2 ఇప్పుడు ఈ రెండు ఈక్వేషన్ వన్ ఏమో ఏ వన్ అనే ఆర్బిటరీ కానిస్టెంట్తో అట్లాగే ఈక్వేషన్ టూని ఏ టూ అనే ఆర్బిటరీ కానిస్టెంట్తో మల్టిప్లై చేస్తే వెయిటెడ్ వాల్యూ వస్తుంది సో ఏ వన్ వై వన్ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఏ వన్ ఎక్స్ వన్ స్క్వేర్ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ దాని ఈక్వేషన్ త్రీ అనుకోండి ఏ టూ వై టూ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఏ టూ ఎక్స్ టూ స్క్వేర్ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ దాని ఈక్వేషన్ ఫోర్ అనుకోండి ఇప్పుడు ఈ ఈక్వేషన్ త్రీ అండ్ ఫోర్ రెండింటిని యాడ్ చేస్తే ఏ వన్ వై వన్ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ ప్లస్ ఏ టూ వై టూ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఏ వన్ ఎక్స్ వన్ స్క్వేర్ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ ప్లస్ ఏ టూ ఎక్స్ టూ స్క్వేర్ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ వీఆర్ గెటింగ్ దీన్ని ఈక్వేషన్ నెంబర్ ఫైవ్ అనుకోండి ఇది వెయిటెడ్ సమ్ ఆఫ్ ఇండివిజువల్ రెస్పాన్సెస్ వచ్చింది మ్యాథమెటికల్ ఎక్స్ప్రెషన్లో రైట్ సైడ్ వాల్యూ వచ్చింది నో టు ఫైండ్ ది ఓవరాల్ రెస్పాన్స్ ఆఫ్ ద సిస్టమ్ టేక్ t of a1 x1 of n plus a2 x2 of n then uh, ichina response of the system lo y of n equal to x square of n undi ee x place lo entire this weighted sum of values anevi substitute chestam so a1 x1 of n plus a2 x2 of n whole square because we are having x square of n so it is in the form a plus b whole square so we will get a square plus b square plus 2ab format so we are getting the expression as a1 square x1 square of n plus a2 square x2 square of n plus 2 a1 a2 x1 square of n into x2 square of n let it is equation number 6 by comparing equations 5 and 6 both equations are not equal so it is not satisfying superposition principle hence the given system is called non-linear system. In this way, by using this simple superposition principle, we will decide the given system is linear or not. Thank you for watching.